flavors. The, the basis of, of a very good preserve is the fruit itself. We pick the first run of fruit. The very first picking has very high pectin levels in. The plant's at its most vigorous. It's producing its highest quality fruit first. And that's the time when we go out and pick the fruit. They come in, they go directly into the freezer, uh, and are frozen solid. The second part is to make sure when they are totally frozen that we'd still treat them as if they weren't. And that's very important because the aromatics stay in the fruit. Then you might say, oh, well, why don't you use fresh fruit? Well, actually, all fruit is macerated. And it's a process of breaking down the skins. And freezing actually is a type of maceration. When we defrost them, it helps us open up the flavor of the fruit. It starts to break down that skin. And that's what you want for a preserve. I often explain to people, when they, when they taste the fruit and they say, well, that's it's kind of acid. It's the acidity of the fruit that defines it, not its sugars. Sugars, we, we, our palate cannot distinguish between different sugars very easily. So don't look at the sugars, look at the acids, because we can always tell the difference between a tomato, a citrus, a plum, a cherry, and it's the acids and the aromatics that define the fruit. I think because we approach this as eaters as opposed to industrialists, the very most important thing is that we take the very best fruit, not the worst fruit, to turn into preserves. That is counterintuitive if you were to get any marketing advice from anybody connected to the world of preserves, because you can conceal an awful lot with sugar and salt and other added additives. So that's what we're selling, quality and if it's not uh, properly done from the beginning with the best fruit and no pectin, you're just going to get something that's inferior. Fruit, sugar, and lemon juice in a jar. It may not be set as thick, but it always has that flavor up front of the fruit. A little bit of summer in the jar, I guess you could call it. So if you, if you share our taste and want the fruit up front, then you'll like our preserves, I hope.